This story is called Peas, and it is written by Anne Hearth. Ava couldn't wait. Grandpa visited the city every year. He always brought something delicious from his garden. He brought raspberries one time and strawberries another time. Knock, knock. He's here. Ava pulled open the door. Grandpa stood in the hall with a big suitcase and a little bag. He gave Ava a big hug and handed her the bag. Yum, Ava said. What's inside? Open it, Grandpa said. Ava peeked into the bag. Oh, she said. Peas. Grandpa sat at the kitchen table. Try one, he said. Raw, Ava said. Yes, Grandpa said and popped a pea into his mouth. Yum, Ava put a pea in her mouth too. She bit into it. It was sweet and crunchy. Yum, she said. She grabbed a handful and crammed them into her mouth. A pea dropped onto the table. It rolled onto the floor and under the refrigerator. I'll get it later, Ava thought as she ate more peas. Grandpa was staying for two weeks. The apartment was quiet after he left. Ava sat at the kitchen table. I miss him, Ava told her mom. Then Ava saw a long green stem poking out from under the refrigerator. Hey, look, Ava said as she jumped up. Ava pulled gently on the vine. It must be the pea I dropped. It's growing. Ava planted the vine in a little pot and put it on the windowsill. It grew taller. Ava tied it to the window frame. Little white flowers popped out. Grandpa, Ava sat on the phone. I'm growing peas. The flowers disappeared and pea pods appeared on Ava's plant. They grew long and fat. Ava picked them. Look, Mom, she exclaimed. She sat at the kitchen table and opened the pods. She ate the peas inside. They were crunchy and sweet. She knew she would be sad when they were gone. She held the last one up between her fingers. Oh no, she said as it slipped onto the floor. It rolled under the refrigerator. That was your last pee, Mom said. Ava thought for a minute. That's okay, she said. She peeked under the refrigerator and giggled. I think we'll have more peas in a few weeks, she said. If you think back to the story, what did Grandpa bring over for Ava? How did Ava get fresh peas after Grandpa left? What was Ava's first reaction to the peas? What do you think will happen next? Thanks for listening.